Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. It's me, Lucy. And this, I'm so excited. This is my first alone video on eTweens. I am so excited. She isn't alone! Jean, I told you you can stay if you promise not to talk. Why? Okay. Anyways, this is called Storytime with Lucy. This would be a good time for all our eTweens viewers to go to the bathroom. Jane, in a appropriate. Whatever. Seriously, you are upsetting all of my fans and our viewers who have been waiting their whole lives just to see this one video, and you're just taking your their little dreams and you're just crushing them, and throwing them on the floor. Whatever. So don't talk, okay? Mind me. Okay. Sorry about that. On to the story now. It's called. Jack and the Beanstalk. Boring. Jane, I'm about to put duct tape on you, okay? So mm -hmm. be quiet. Once upon a time, there was an old woman who lived in a Thumbletown cottage with her only son, Jack. Because she couldn't afford him thanks to the economy going down. Jane, stop. They grew poorer and poorer until... One day, all they had left was their cow. Why couldn't they eat the cow? Who said anything about eating? Jane, you are way ahead. I had the story 50 times. You are ahead. Our viewers may have never heard this story in their lives. So, just let them enjoy it, okay? Jack, said Mother, you must take the cow to the market and sell her. Or we shall so starve. Like and I said, they should have eaten it. Mother is still talking. Do not interrupt Mother. <clears throat> and mind you, get a good price for her. The next morning, Jack set off for the market on his bicycle. Wait a minute! What? This is in the Middle Ages. They had no bikes. Yeah, they did. I'm looking at a picture right here with a little boy on a bicycle. Who okay. wrote this story? Geniuses. That's who. Anyways, the cow trotting along behind on a rope. Along the road, Jack met a man passing by. The man looked at the cow. Then he said to the lad, Will you swap your cow for some beans? Some beans? I want a wedding so that cow and got myself a sports car! Jane, I'm about to hit you with the cow, okay? There is no cow in the house! I will go to the farm, get a cow, hit you with it, return it to the farm, and be back by dinner. Sorry, but that cow became hamburgers. We ain't good for a week! Jane, don't say that kind of thing on the internet. Dear sweet Margaret, rest in peace. I loved that cow. <clears throat> Back to the story. No, Jack replied. I must sell my cow at the market so that I can buy food to eat. But these are magic beans, said the man, reaching into his pocket and pulling out a few old brown beans. Old oh, brown beans! Oh my god! Why couldn't the boy realize it? Those beans were rotting! They're magic. Who's magic said? beans? are always brown. Everybody knows magic beans are brown. Who said? The joke shop? Jane, just let me finish the story. Scatter them on the ground and they'll make your fortune. So in the end, Jack agreed to, the, to swap this cow for a handful of old brown beans. Jack put the beans in his pocket and went home. Look what I've got, he shouted to his mother, holding out a handful of beans. But the old woman screeched. Is that all you got for my precious cow? She was so angry that she snatched the beans and threw them out the window. She scolded her son and sent him to bed without so much as a crumb of bread. And the boy called 911 reporting child abuse. Jean, you're saying that it's crazy that there's bicycles? Really? And you think they had fun? Hey, I would have done that if I was her kid. You wouldn't have a phone to call the cops, Jane. Gee, I would have ran out the window, head to the police station, and yell, I'm being abused by a nasty old lady! She didn't feed me a single thing! Jane! What is wrong with you? I don't know. I just like doing this. 
I can tell. Next morning, Jack woke to find a gigantic beanstalk had grown outside his bedroom window during the night. Woohoo! He's winning the vegetable contest this year! That's right he is. Yeah, you're right. He is going to win. And you're going to stop talking, okay? Yeah, he'll win. Second place. <laughs> That's the giant <laughs> carrot. Carrots? You think they had carrots back then? Yeah. Thick. Yeah. A little girl named Julia. <laughs> a little girl named <laughs> Julia. <laughs>